Good morning, Internet. Today is an assumed day, apparently. So he's being very squirrely today, so I wouldn't expect him to last too long. No. I'm still not feeling that great, and fortunately, I think I ended up with a slight fever yesterday. Feeling better today, but still far from 100%. I'm probably about 60 ish percent today. I will hopefully be better tomorrow. Today I want to talk about something. Yeah. Today I'll talk about cats. Might as well. I mean, yesterday's video was about cats after all. So, I have had cats my entire life. Um, my mom likes describing it as there was a cat that gave birth to kittens right around the time that I was born. And the mother cat would drag all of her kittens over to where I was at so she could watch all of us at the same time. I had cats asleep on top of my crib. Um, I had a transparent crib lid. I don't think those are allowed anymore. In any case, I had cats asleep on top of my crib. I grew up with cats. The mother cat assumed that I was just another one of her kittens. I don't really have memories of this, obviously. Um, my first memories of having a cat would have been Sam. Oh, I had Sam, let's see, Sam moved up with me from Florida the first time, so I would have had Sam since at least I was three. Sam was, a, at the time, a somewhat large male tomcat. Uh, well, neutered, so I guess not technically a tom. Sam was my kitty. I know that Sam was more my mother's kitty, but really, Sam spent the night with me. Sam woke me up in the morning. Sam was my cat. Unfortunately, Sam had urinary tract issues, and yeah. I also had Cookie. Cookie was another kitty, got pregnant, had four kittens, that would be... Badger, Greystroke, Frickin' Frack. Um, I'm the one that named Badger and Greystroke. Badger and Greystroke were more my kitties. Frickin' Frack were more my father's kitties. Mm. Badger was rather stupid for a cat. Um, you know, the whole crazy cat hour run around the house really, really fast. She would run around the house really, really fast and then hit a wall head first. As hard as she could. Over and over and over again. She would also find a way to twist her body around when she would fall to land on her head. Pretty sure she was brain damaged. She was very lovable. Um, she did claw me up quite a bit, but that's less type of claw and more just having your claws out while running around and running on top of my lap. I lived in Florida so I always wear shorts and yeah. Graystroke on the other hand was very similar appearing to Isun here. Um, so Grey Tabby. She was very thin. Ate everything in sight. Cat food. People food. She really liked Season's french fries. Um, she would actually inhale them. It barely looked like she even chewed. I no longer had Badger and Graystroke when I moved to the second to last place I lived in in Florida because they did not allow for pets. Unfortunately, I had to give up my precious kitties. I'm very sad about that. and It's made me overly attached to any cat beyond that. So, let's see, I would have moved to that place 7th grade, so 12, yeah, I think that's about right. And then I did not have cats again until I lived here, so these kitties, these kitties are 2 years and 6 months old, roughly, um, two, year, 2 years and 8 months, actually. That's my history with cats. Um, there's a saying that every life should have nine cats. Well, I've had a lot more than nine cats if you count the 
kitties that I don't remember from being a baby. I think I had nine cats when I was born. Mm, he's purring. I don't know if you can hear that. I'm going to end today's vlog. Um, wish I would have more content. If you have recommendations for what I should talk about, please put them in. I can always use some assistance. Preferably when I'm so brain fried and not feeling all that great. Yes, soon, I'm going to need to get up so I can turn off the camera. Mm. Okay, I'll give you a little bit longer of kitty love. Well, enjoy internet.